Carlos, we're at Broadway Engineering in Leon. Bristol, yes. um, and, and it's a fantastic facility you have here. But today I want to have a look at some of these fifth axis components that you're manufacturing. Now, how did you used to manufacture these components before? I'd say in the past we had to actually maybe use uh, three and four axis machines, and then probably even go on to a conventional machine to complete the rest. It is quite a complex part, and um, it requires a lot of attention. Um, accuracy wise it's also very accurate um, so we're doing it on the five axis we're able to actually make the part with precision uh, it's consistent and it's much quicker so how many operations were you doing this component um, did it take to do this component before previously as I can remember it took about eight to ten, ten uh, operations to do it um, yeah we're using a number of tooling but uh, it's still much quicker. We are doing this operation in two operations now. So on the DMG Mori DMU50 Evo linear, you've effectively saved eight operations. Now, yeah. the operations is one massive time-saving factor, but the Correct. setup times, each setup time must have, you know, took, took a long time to set each operation previously. Um, yeah, previously it did take um, a long time because we had to look for all tooling holders, all that necessary stuff. Uh, what we try and do here at Broadway is uh, we got toolkits already prepared and uh, programmed in, on the machine as well and with our processors so it's able and we much quicker in actually uh, do a setup time on that. Now for critical parts, for aerospace parts such as this, you know also doing it in two operations surely it's improving the quality of the part because it's keeping the relationships between each face and feature consistent. Most definitely, in that aspect, we can uh, guarantee uh, that you know what comes out of the, these machines is actually precise and consistent all the time. So, with this fifth axis machine, well, your sale of DMG yeah. Mori fifth axis machines, how are you finding the repeatability and the accuracy of actually the machine? Uh, repeatability is very good. Obviously, you've got to watch your tools from time to time, and it depends always on um, the material you're actually machining but very good, uh, the repeatability. Now, I've noticed that you've requested directly from DMG Murray to have all of your machines with hiding iron control. Can you tell me the reason we, behind this? Yes, uh, we did. The uh, reason is because we've got milli machines on our top shop and everything is hiding iron and it would be much so much easier for all the operators and programmers to program in only one language instead of going over to Fanuc or Siemens. Uh, I don't know, we found it to be more user friendly. Now, you know, you do a lot of medium um, volume work, so you, you're doing a lot of setups all the time, I would imagine, yeah. Carlos. Now, do you actually still do some programming on the machine? We do, we do some alterations on the machine. Uh, mostly, most of the, the program is actually made offline. Um, so, uh, we do actually change a few things on the machine and the programming uh, to ensure that the part is correct. So. To summarise really, Carlos, this, this new sale of DM, DMU50 Evo Linear uh, machines from DMG Murray, have they been a game changer for Broadway engineering? We definitely think so because it's uh, in a lot of our work it's actually saved um, time and uh, operations and manpower. So yeah, it definitely has been a game changer. What's the next step? You know, where, where are you going to go next? Uh, the next step, according to our management, is obviously we want to prove and be more competitive in the industry. Um, we intend to uh, robotize uh, the machines, obviously probably modify them and uh, go into pellets and, uh, and special chucks. Automation? Automation, yeah. Automation. Well, can you call MTD back in to, to video it once this has been done? Um, I definitely think so because it's going to be uh, progress not only for the company but to show our customer how we're actually uh, benefiting from everything that we got or acquired.